Hey everyone, welcome back to On the Fence Movie Reviews. I am Adrian. And I'm Rob. So today we're going to be talking about Scoob. So Scoob is an animated, uh, I think it's like the first CGI uh, adaptation or animated feature of uh, the Scooby-Doo. And it kind of starts off and gives a backstory of uh, how uh, Shaggy met Scooby and the adventure takes off from there. I grew up as a big Scooby-Doo fan and I, he always has a big near uh, spot near and dear my heart. So I was excited when this one came out. So excited that I missed it. So Rob, why don't you go ahead and let us know how it was. <laughs> well, that's, that's a lot of, it's a lot of excitement, Adrian. Um, okay. So I, I was, uh, when this movie, when I seen the trailer for this movie, I was like, ah, you know, it, it looks okay. Probably not yeah. up my alley. Um, but you know, you get those movies like, uh, like a Toy Story, yeah, and you know, like uh, I don't know, uh, Monsters Inc. You get those movies that just kind of resonate with you. And I'm not gonna put this the Scooby movie on on uh, that kind of level. Okay, but, I was gonna say that's pretty high praise. <laughs> right, right. No, I'm not in that kind of level. But as far as Honestly, the same with you. I grew up watching Scooby Doo. Um, I really enjoyed the cartoon, and uh, I it was just it's someplace it has a hold it has a hold on my heart, and I really like it. So when I when I started to watch this movie, um, I was actually really surprised at how much I really enjoyed this movie. I thought it was going to be, you know, for kids, and it does. It has like the I feel like it has you know that kind of dumb kind of humor that even in the older cartoons they have. But it's more, yeah. I feel like it's more up to date. Um, and they do, there's a lot of uh, references, like as far as um, just like modern day references. It, I, okay. I know the cartoon just more like kind of takes place. I, what is it like? So they, they try to update it for, it sounds like it's, they tried to update it for like younger Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and, and I feel like, more I feel current. like in some spots it, it misses a little bit, but okay. in some spots it hits it right on point. And uh, I was actually watching it with my wife and we were both just kind of like throughout the movie, we were just kind of like cackling our heads off, just different, the humor in it. I feel okay, like cool. it's aimed at you. You obviously know who it's aimed for. It's aimed at kids, but I, there's things in there where as an adult, you're going to get the reference because you understand it's going to go over kids' heads, but as an yeah. adult, you're going to catch it. Um, so that part, I really, really did enjoy about it. If I were going to say, um, any negatives uh it would be that there is like the the kind of the stupid scooby-doo humor and there is um you know those jokes that you know that kids are gonna laugh at but you okay. know it's not it's not aimed towards adults they're aiming for the kids um there's a lot so of so it sounds like the story might be just a little bit too simple and and it, not it is it is very simple to... and um as i was watching it i i honestly i was just like watching it and I was like hey like this reminds me of this movie that I just watched and this kind of reminds me of this movie yeah, that I so just watched. Yeah, so there's nothing that was it sounds like, it was like nothing like really original but No, yeah, no, yeah sounds, not nothing original but I I mean but it, but it I, I sounds have, lighthearted enough that it that it kind of Oh yeah, I have to and, honestly say and that you I, it. and I was laughing. I was laughing through the entire movie. So it was enjoyable. Cool. You know the, the the parts that weren't funny for me, but there was enough parts that kept me entertained. And obviously my yeah. wife was like chuckling through the entire movie. So, uh, cool. I mean, I, I definitely enjoyed it. So Rob, will you recommend? I'm definitely, to I'm going to say, I'm going to go ahead and get off the fence. And I say, you should definitely get off the fence, especially I if you're a Scooby-Doo fan and, uh, and, and check it if out. If it wasn't and, for these meddling kids, I would, definitely get <laughs> off the fence and go watch it yes yes um, um yeah but yeah no definitely get off the fence and check it out especially if you're a scooby-doo fan yeah cool well guys why don't you comment down below and let us know what you thought of scoob and uh let us know if you liked it if you didn't like it it was just okay um also don't forget to click uh, like subscribe share and also uh follow us on instagram at on the fence movie reviews for behind the scenes content and uh, other things that we post on there throughout the week and just to uh, Keep following us. All right. And remember, we'll catch you on the